BMW has given consideration to producing a Ute, but such a model would be unlike the appalling Mercedes-Benz X-Class, according to BMW Group Senior Vice President of Asia-Pacific and South Africa Hendrik von Kuenheim. Speaking to Australian journalists at the Frankfurt Motor Show this week, Mr. von Kuenheim took aim at Mercedes's Nissan Navara-based entrant in the pickup segment by comparing its interior to that of the US market Ford F-150. When you look now at our German competitor from Stuttgart, I think that the product is appalling," he said. You would have expected something more serious. This is for me, and I listened to yesterday some of your media colleagues from other countries saying, oh, that's very cheap, very plasticky, not very much Mercedes like what you would expect. Questioned about the possibility of BMW fielding a Ute competitor, Mr. Von Kuenheim said future products are reliant on the development of segments over time, while he recalled the objection to SUVs within the company before it eventually released the volume selling X5. I remember very much the heated discussions, the heated discussion 20-some years ago, when an SUV was considered, does it fit BMW? Now we have an X1, X2, X3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and who knows what else is coming. The market and the customer demand is changing. Mr. Von Kuenheim confessed there are few pickup markets, adding that despite the brand's heavy investment in electrified vehicles and autonomous technologies, it was presently only making money on traditional petrol and diesel cars. Therefore, he highlighted the importance of prioritizing these projects, with a Ute currently sitting lower down on the scale for BMW. So you need to prioritize yourself. What do we want to do? And from all the priorities, the pickup is maybe not number one or number two priority. Mr. Von Kuenheim revealed he has a photo of a pickup, among several other things, on his phone cover as a prompt to advance this agenda with upper BMW management, which partly comes in reaction to BMW Group Australia's push, led by Chief Executive Mark Werner, for a view to be added to the carmaker's model lineup. Mark is fighting for this very hard, and every six months my team is making me a new phone cover," he said. It's what's going on in my region. Just to remember always what is the priority in my region, and there is a pickup on my phone cover, just to remember when I am talking to the board, these are my priorities. Mr. Von Kuenheim confirmed BMW has looked into how the Ute could be engineered, but reiterated that the company would not mimic Mercedes's efforts with the X-Class. I am well aware that BMW engineers have looked into detail what it takes, he said. I saw the car, X-Class, obviously in Geneva. I was actually disappointed, very disappointed. They can do better. They built fantastic cars, but this one it was a disappointment. While Europe is not a substantial market for Utes, Mr. Von Kuenheim said key individuals within BMW are keen to see a pickup hit the road. There are a lot of people at BMW, and now I leave you in the doubt, they say before they retire they would like to have a pickup to go into retirement.
One of those is big financial honcho, but right now not the number one priority, he said. For Australia, it is important, no question about it. I acknowledge very clear. Back on April Fool's Day in 2011, BMW unveiled an M3 pickup show car, but Mr. Von Kuenheim's comments are the first indication that the car maker is taking a serious look at the segment. At the Frankfurt Motor Show this week, BMW whipped the covers off its X7 concept providing a preview of the competitor it will field in the upper-large premium SUV segment. Affiatur Ute is likely to adopt a similar look if it eventuates. Mr. Werner said it was not necessarily a requirement to offer a pickup in the range, while such a product would have to stay true to the BMW brand. At the end of day, the question is really does it fit to the brand or not, or are we stretching the boundaries here? And I still believe, doing a pickup, it has to be the right fit to the brand, he said. We speak about BMW, and obviously it is all about performance, it is about agility, luxury, So it would have to be a BMW typical interpretation of a car. An OT, what we are currently seeing in the market. It has to stand out.